You guys made some decisions over the last 36 hours as to who's going to play and who's who's going to uh, be part of the scout team and so on. What were some of those decisions that everybody made on the staff? Well, you mean as far as running the backs. running backs? Well, you know, we, we, we've done a lot of things with Byron, so, um, um, you know, he's been kind of going playing two different roles, playing running back and wide receiver. Um, and um, um, we've got um, Thomas at the tailback. We'll have Byron, and then there'll be Royce Freeman. Those are those are going to be the 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 three guys that will probably see most of the playing time in the to be, to begin of the game. Are you pretty confident as to uh, the talent that you guys have available at that in the one, two, three position? Um, given Royce is a Freeman, how confident are you that these guys can produce in a way that turns heads across the nation? Well, well I'm very confident in those guys. I, as a matter of fact, I'm, I'm confident in, in all of our guys back there. The, the, the five guys that we have there this year are all quality guys. They're, I wouldn't be afraid to put any of them on the field. I think any of them could, could be a starter at any time during the season. And as you know, it's a long season, and that could easily happen. That, the fifth guy could end up being the number one guy. So uh, I, I think we've probably got the deepest to backfield talent-wise as we've had since I've been here. Was it a tough decision? What is an, was it a no-brainer decision about Royce and having him play this year? I'd say it was a no-brainer to have him play. Uh, I was pretty, pretty sure that uh, that was going to happen uh, during the recruiting process. Uh, he's an outstanding athlete. I think the only only question in my mind was, would he make the transition to college football? And that's been answered for me. What has he shown you that is that made it so easy to say yes? He's made that transition, and he's made it look pretty darn good. Well, he's got he's got great running ability. He he has very good vision. He's a strong runner. He's got very good speed. Uh, he's he's a very good open field runner. He can make people miss. He can break tackles. He catches the ball well. He blocks. He's a, he's an all around athlete, and he does all those things very well. Is there anything unique, something that separates, dis, uh, distinguishes Byron Thomas and Royce as them as their own thing? Um, is there any one characteristic that each of them has that maybe the other does not have? Well, I think they all obviously. Um, are individual players and have their own talents. Byron is a is an all-around guy who can who can run great routes. That's why we're going to do some things with him. Uh, he has good hands and, and he's a smart football player. Um, and I think they're all very smart players. Obviously, Royce uh, coming in as a freshman, learning this offense and and, and excelling in it, uh, has to be a smart football player to, to pick up this offense that he's really not familiar with. And Thomas has shown that uh, he's a powerful guy, and um, I think he's probably the fastest guy out of the three guys. Uh, and he has learned to, to use his strength and his body size to break tackles. And uh, all three of them have really good hands. Uh, so that's they, they all have some common traits, but they all do things just a little bit different. What have uh, Byron and Thomas been uh, saying? What have they been doing to try and get everybody else, the rest of this core, ready for South Dakota next week? Well, I think um, you know all of our veterans are very good at helping our younger players along. Um, I was talking to Royce yesterday, and I told him that uh, I thought he did a really good job in fall camp, and he said that he really learned a lot from, from Byron and Thomas. Uh, they helped him along. Uh, I could see them coaching him when I was doing something else, they were coaching him along, making sure that he could be the best he can be. You know, they all they all take this as a team effort. So we all want to be as good as we can be.